Here we are with another video close up of the peppers. Hopefully this one will be more focused. This is a Carolina Reaper store bought. They don't have the tip like the one that I grew. I'll show you that here in a bit. Have quite a few of those. They're actually doing pretty good. For here we have scorpion. Check out those huge fruits. They're absolutely massive. Looking really good. Oh, and that died and shriveled up. We also have here is a ghost. <coughs> Habanero. If I remember correctly. Caribbean red habanero. Chocolate ghost. Or at least that's what my hope is. Look at that baby. Not a whole lot of fruit on this one yet, but... We're gonna get some. Bummer part is that the one that has them, the branching that has the most flowers on it is right next to the plastic. So hopefully this is spaced off uh, away from it enough that they won't freeze. This right here is a seven pot. South of the border, look at that tip. Excited to see how those will come out. Also have here some chocolate hot, um, sorry, brown jalapenos. I have even one over there on the other side that is starting to turn brown. Very nice. Lemon drops, they will turn yellow. They haven't yet, but this plant has just blown up. It is really big. You can see all those peppers on there. Nice crisp taste, really good, good heat. Chinese five color, been growing these for quite a few years. Lots on this plant. These do change to five different colors. Let me go around. Here we have a new pepper plant trying this year called Puma. Nice sharp heat, good flavor. I The coloring doesn't seem to give off the flavor of like a chocolate habanero or a chocolate ghost. But we've only had a few so far. Buena Muertas, good death. They too change colors. Good flavoring, good heat. Brazilian starfish. It's very tall. This has barely started fruiting. I have more at my other garden area. They give a star like star like off of it. A uh, star like shape, sorry. Look at that ghost down there. Move around here. <coughs> Habanero. See one of those Caribbean red habaneros changing color. This is a Spanish style Caribbean red. That's why they look slightly different compared to these habaneros. Here's the Carolina Reaper that I grew from the seed. You can see that point. Maybe. We can't get it to focus. Another over here. A few of those. Here's that brown jalapeno that's changing colors. Can't wait to see what that looks like. 
see what flavor they give off once they're brown. Cayennes. Lots of cayennes. Three plants of those. Another one there. And then here is the scotch bonnets. They get just as chunky. Good flavor, have a citrus flavor or a sweeter flavor. I have picked quite a few, so I'll take a picture or uh, get a video shot of those. So here's everything that I have harvested so far. Actually, this is probably the third picking. Here's the scotch bonnets. Banana peppers, which I have over there at the other garden. Missouri starfish accidentally broke a branch, so I have those here. A couple of serranos. The pumas. The buena muertas. The Chinese five color. Caribbean red. I honestly can't remember which one this fell off of. Here's the lemon drops. Pretty, aren't they? So, this is potentially all the colors, all the styles. That one's a reaper. That one came off of the plant that I broke. Pretty nice. There you go.